Well, welcome back, everybody. I hope you're all having a great day. So we are still down here in the catacombs. Last episode, I darkened this up a bit, trying to make it more creepy. I still got this problem really light back here, but that'll be fine. Actually, it kind of gives an eerie thought. You got to go through this dark area before you get to the light area. And I did go through and add in a bunch more names onto all the crypts. So we're all through here. Um, I'm probably going to have some more of these little things on the opposite side because this path here, this is going to go down this way. And then we'll probably skip all this and then make another path like down here. So the area I'll skip will be the same length as this. So I'll build two more of these little chambers, you know, out on this side with the connecting hallway way over here. So you'll go down here and you can go into the two over there and there'll be two more over here. So that should give us plenty of rooms. And then here, oh, I thought there were three of them? Four. My plan for three, but I've actually got four. So, well, we'll just make an adjustment. So this area here is going to be like um, sh little shrines. Probably with, you know, like holding icons or something. I don't have any space. I filled up my inventory with all these blocks. I do have the gap back here, so I've got plenty of light coming across. I'm not really worried about making this super dark. And then this is going to mirror over here. So, like right about, yeah, so like right uh, here that yep that'll be the uh, the connecting pillar there so we're going to have a mirror on this side so I need to clean some of this out because I'm going to need to probably put this cobble here so it'll be a you know basically a, a duplicate of that And these are just little cubby holes where you put your icons in. I do need, uh, where is, there. Boy, I don't have any inventory. So let's uh, just temporarily swap that one out. I always seem to need a bigger inventory in this game. Just trying to make it look kind of not creepy, but yeah, so these are the little shrines in the back. Let's do this. And then we could do... I hope this is going to work for what it... We'll find out pretty soon. So far no red X's, so that's always good. And then for the final wall, I think I'm just, yeah, we'll just put the stone brick in there. Uh, and this wall. Like that. Nothing too fancy. And then a wall in between.
There. Okay, so that's a start for the cubby. So I've got these little emerald blocks. This is where my icons are going to sit on top of. Like that. And then this will be a fence in between here. A wall so you, no one can get back there. And then for the icons, I just picked up some stuff I have sitting in my inventory. They're just something that will look and unique or interesting. I'm going to need, like I said, I, I calculated for three, so I've only got a set of six. So I'm going to need to get two more. And then like some of these, I've got a skeleton head, which are very, very rare in this world because I am in a survival world. So you can, getting heads is uh, very scary. You've got to either go to a deep, dark city or you have, which is where I got that one from, or you need to set up an explosive creeper, one of those supercharged creepers, and they have a chance of getting a mob head if they blow up and kill a mob. And that's kind of a pain because you got to get the creeper, you got to get them hit by lightning, and then you've got to uh, get them near a bob and have them blow up and not kill yourself. Well, I guess you could kill yourself as long as you had a bed nearby. So it's not the easiest thing to get. Although if you had a, one of those little throwing uh, tridents or whatever with, a, I think, a charging on it or something, it attracts lightning. So that could, that is one way to do it. It makes it a little easier. I thought it'd be kind of nice to have these little icon, little cubby holes. So you come down here and these are just iconography or things, you know, important little uh, things that they've collected over the years. So that is that side. I need to get, a, like I said, two more. And these aren't going to be, you know, they're all going to be unique each in each one because I've got like a gas here and a chanting bottle and golden apples and stuff. So I guess I just need to clear this out now. We've got this cleared out over here. So put it in the floor. Oops, there. I may have enough. Oh, I'm one short. That sucks. Ugh. I will have to go get one more. This here, these go out this way. Just doing this from memory. Luckily, I can look over here and go, oh, yep, there we go. Oops, that's not right. There we go. And I think I'll need to add a little curvature on there because it is a little flat. Let's see. I'm just trying to remember. I guess it doesn't have to be exact. I'm not doing, you know, really going for symmetry. I'm just going for a medieval, you know, crypt look. So as long as it's got these bricks in some kind of form, it should be okay. Let's do, actually, let's do this. There. Just make sure I throw in some of this uh, mossy. Maybe even another brick there. Ah. 
I will stick with the pattern. You know, the pattern on the walls, which was the two cobble on the bottom and then the stone brick on the top. Although no one's, well, I guess no one's going to pay attention except for anyone watching this video and me. So. so I can just do whatever the heck I want. But I'm trying to get something that looks a little, at least a little uh, consistent or designed. I think my voice is going. I'm getting a little hoarse for some reason. Probably allergies. It is allergy season. They're in full force. End of spring, beginning of summer. I've got trees and grass and all that kind of junk flying in the air. So I am getting a little uh, probably sinusy. Not sniffly, which is usually usually I go for the go for the sniffles, but this time I'm. Uh, just going for the uh, congestion can't talk. Oh, I forgot to get other banners. I need two more banners. I did remember the emerald. And I got my item frame. So like here, I've got an echo shard. I'd imagine that is hard to come by. We have a... Oops. I've got an item frame and an item frame. Let's see, that's uh, enchanting juices. We have a netherite scrap, because those are probably, you know, unique items. And an enchanted apple. And then over here, we'll put the gas tier. So let me, I just need to get a couple, uh, let's see, some andesite. Polished andesite. Two banners. And then we should be about done. Oh, that's dark. Let's do... Um, let's do this. This doesn't help with the lighting, but it does give it atmosphere. Um, da, 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 there. That takes care of that. Well, I guess I better do this uh, wall over here, too. And I'll probably get a uh, candle, put some sconces through here. So we got that, that's fine. Let's do. Oh, andesite. Forgot that polished andesite. There we go. Let's get rid of this and replace it with uh, the brick. And then do that. Just trying to make a an arch doorway. Yeah, because they're gonna want. Because you know, this big square open door doesn't look good. So putting a little arch on here helps. Uh, there we go. Oops. The only thing I think is maybe put, maybe put a slab there, but I, that'll make it too square, I think. 
So the only Earth option would be maybe a. Yeah, I actually think it looks better if I put a solid block there. Oh, not one of those though. Oh, yeah, it does with the the inset and stuff. That makes it look a lot different. It looks a lot nicer. I'm probably going to lose, lose some blocks here. What's... Uh, what the heck? Uh, if I get the right block here, there we go. Let's go here. There, just in case I dropped. Although I've got so much stone, I, I'm just going to let them go. I don't think I need to worry about them. I'm going to do this. Do that. Because then it's got an even balance right there. And this is a little wider. Yeah, it kind of kicked in too far. I almost need to move this. Dang it. This almost needs to come back one block. But I'm not going to worry about that. I think the compensate I'll do uh, like this. Kind of a, do a double pillar. There. I th yeah, that, I think that'll work. Okay, there's my icon, little icon displays. There. So I think that's all I'm going to do today. Uh, in the meantime, between episodes, I'm going to go through here and lay out more of these rooms, and then we'll come back and fill all those in. Although they'll look about the same as that one. So it's going to be pretty straightforward. And then kind of just push this wall out all the way over there. And then I do need to put the ceiling back in here because I only did ceiling over to that side. So I need to go through here and put a ceiling. So, so that will be uh, next up. I want to thank you all for watching. I uh, hope you're having a great day. Continue to have a great day and I'll see you later. Bye bye.